Hi everyone! So I'm going to cut open a, a honey melon. Um, it's another fruit here, but it's a new melon I've never tried. So I figured I'd bring you guys along with me again, of course. I bought this melon at my Oriental Market. Now when I say market, it's not, or like a market, it's not like a market in the lower 48 that you see, you guys, that's outside or anything. It's just a general store. Um, a small store and that's how it is in my area in Alaska here. There's no farmers markets like in the lower 48 that you see, okay? <laughs> but anyways, um, I got it at my oriental market and it's called a honey melon and it's a small melon and I was like, okay, I gotta try it and I let it go as long, let it ripen as long as possible because it's soft. It turned like the color really turned and it's got a sweet aroma. So let's get, let's open this guy up and give him a little tasty taste test here because I'm very curious on this melon for how small it is. I'm just, I'm very curious. And it's called a honey melon. So of course that gives you a little clue like it must taste like honey, right? Well, let's look at it. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Ain't that just the cutest little melon you've ever seen? Maybe we can turn on another light. I don't know. Does that help there, guys? My lighting's so bad. I'm so sorry. <gasps> Maybe that's better. Look at that. That is so cool. It smells a lot like, I can tell you right now that it smells a lot like those um, golden honeydew melons, which are my absolute favorite. So what we're going to do is um, I need to get the seeds out. So... Oh, that's so cool. Actually, all these seeds are going to go out into the garden. Wow, a lot of tiny little tiny little seeds there. I don't know if you guys want to watch there. But it is most definitely, it's like a mini melon. Like a mini melon. Got out. But it was in, at my Oriental Market, so it's not one of those average melons that you see, I guess. Well, obviously not, since in the grocery stores like Fred Meyers and Safeway, I never see melons like this. So you always see the standard cantaloupes, watermelons, cannery yellow melons. But let's go ahead and give this a tasty taste test here, guys. Wow. Oh, it's kind of, whoa, it's kind of firm. I let it ripen as long as possible. This might be a melon fail, you guys. <laughs> but you never know. It just could be the type of, type of the melon for how the the fruit is. So could be just a crunchy melon. Mmm. Oh yes. Whoa. I can see why it's called a honey melon. Whoa, that is sweet. And you know what? I'm not sure if any of you guys have tried a honey melon once before, but my take on this is that it's maybe meant to be a little bit more firm. Maybe it's meant to be a firm type of melon, but I can't let it ripen any longer because it's starting to mold. So I don't know, I gotta try another one, but it's sweet. It's just, it's crunchy though. Hang on guys, sorry. Sorry, but it's it's crunchy though. Let's give it another tasty taste here. It's very sweet. It tastes very similar to a golden honeydew. But look how, man, this is like, I'm just a little confused because melons are supposed to be soft. Like soft. Now, I mean, when usually when a fruit is really firm like that, that means it's not really ripe. But like I said before, it could be just the nature of the fruit. Like this type of melon could be a more firmer melon. But a little corn for you. Mmm. But it's dang sweet. It's not bad at all. It's really good. I can see why it's called a honey melon. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. -hmm. It's definitely a melon I would buy again.
if I see this at the Oriental Market, I'll pick up, I'll probably pick up probably three or four of them. They're really good. Wow, they're really sweet. My goodness, that surprised Miss Stace here, guys. I really did. But that, it's, it's very, it's, wow. It reminds me a lot of a cannery yellow melon or a golden honeydew melon. You got to try it for yourself, you guys. Okay, guys, remember to love being raw. Put a big old smile on your face today. I hope I did that for you guys. And I'll see you guys next video, okay? Bye, guys.